Hello, Mountaineer family. Misha Poor here, Vice President for the Division of Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion. Let's talk. Today, let's talk about self-care. Self-care is very important, even under the best of circumstances. In 2020 and now into 2021, it's pretty clear these are not ideal circumstances, but I hope it's getting a little better for you. We need to be mindful and very intentional about taking care of our physical and mental health during this time. If you're having difficulties, it's okay not to be okay. I hope that you will seek out resources and support available to you through WVU and those around you. Reach out to your RA, the Carew Center, the faculty staff assistant programs, your friends and your family. They want to hear from you and they care about you. So what does self-care look like? Well, it doesn't have to be elaborate. It can be small things like watering your plants, listening to music, cooking, looking at a movie, reading a book, taking a nap, and guess what? Whew, just breathing. It's really important to acknowledge that some of the reasons we need self-care in the first place is because of stressors and systems beyond our control. If you're struggling to figure out what self-care is for you, you haven't failed in any way. Societies are built around systems and structures that produce lots of stressors and anxiety. Our jobs is to figure out how to manage them, identify them, and interrupt them when at all possible. Remember to be patient and extend a little grace to others, but most importantly, yourself. Like they say, when you know better, you do better, and we all can do better. Now, I'm about to go get some ice cream and look at a little TV. Until next time, let's go Mountaineers.